organizations are sometimes awash in money at the end. You know, six months before an election, 18 months before an election, um, there's not enough in the way of resources. People need time and organizations need time to do good planning. If you know that you're gonna have $500,000 over the next year, you can hire the right people, create a program that is matched to the level of the resources you're gonna get. And that's why you know I've tried to practice what I preach and have started a few different monthly donations to different funds at MVP. You can decide to focus your dollars on a particular issue like climate change. You can focus your dollars on a particular community of voters. For example, indigenous groups, black folks. That's one of the great things about the flexibility of donating through MVP. I may not be in the state of Arizona, but oh wow, Jennifer donated to the fund that gave us money. That's gotta be a relief to them. And I've been in some of their briefings where groups say just that, like that, you know, that MVP took our group from here to here and we would not be able to um, reach people in the way that we have without them. The support from MVP has been critical to our work, right? This is one of the few sources that gives unrestricted funding that trust the leadership of people of color on the ground, that trust our expertise. The work that we're doing is paving the way for those wins to be able to happen. Joe Biden wins the electoral votes out of Arizona. 